a raid by Pakistan's Federal Investigation Agency on the country's cricket board office has riled up former board chief Najam Sethi. Hello and welcome to The Print and to know more on this, let's go to Pakistan. Now, according to local reports, the FIA raided the PCB office late on Monday night, seized records and arrested a few officials who were involved with the sale of tickets during the New Zealand-Pakistan T20 series. Former Chief of Pakistan Cricket Board, Najam Sethi, now came out in defense of the valued professional who was arrested, which is the head of the ticketing counter, Mahavish Omar. But, in accusing the FIA of misbehaving with the staff and batting for Omar, Sethi has pressed a sensitive nerve of Pakistani fans who have long witnessed the missing accountability of institutions in Pakistan. The ac accusation of embezzlement of money through e-ticketing sales of PSL was made by ticketing company BookMe. There were, however, some Pakistanis who did not agree with Sethi's claims. They said that even Sethi's policies from back when he was PCB chief had impacted the board and that he should not be defending corrupt officers. Another user said that it was Sethi himself who had set the precedent by ousting Ramiz Raja. In December 2022, former cricketer Ramiz Raja was removed as chairman of the Pakistan Cricket Board by the then government and instead a 14-member board which was headed by Najam Sethi was appointed. This was following the team's 3-0 loss in England in the 2022 test series. Now, after Sethi's post, Twitter users commented on his post calling for accountability. A Twitter user wrote, and I quote, Accountability is most important. What you and Zaka Ashraf did in PCB is not hidden from us. Both of you are responsible for destroying unity in the team and for starting an agenda against one of our batsmen, Babur Azam. Now you are defending corrupt workers. Another said that it was Mohsin Raza Nakvi, the interior minister and the chairman of PCB who had himself ordered the raid and not book me the company. He said, and I quote, Mohsin Nakvi Sahab probably ordered the raid since he controls both PCB and the FIA. I would in fact ask the authorities to investigate how book me owners became so influential that they ordered a raid. This looks like a case of whose daughter is whose wife and whose sister is whose daughter-in-law. So what is this ticketing company BookMe? It is a Pakistani startup that conducted the Asia Cup in Pakistan and Sri Lanka in 2023. According to Pakistani media reports, BookMe was the first Pakistani company ever to exclusively handle Asia Cup tickets and it is a Pakistani e-ticketing platform which is known for digitizing tickets and bookings in travels, hotels, tours and events. It also has a customer base of over 10 million. In his Twitter post, Sethi said that despite choosing to not comment on the state of affairs in PCB, the member's arrest had compelled him to highlight how the accusations that were levelled against Mahavish Omar were absurd. He also called it one party's personal grudge. His tweet read, Mahavish has played a pivotal role in the growth of Pakistan cricket. First in PSL and then when she was managing ticketing as international cricket had just returned to Pakistan. Now she is being accused by the FIA of embezzling around 80,000 Pakistani rupees. To give you context, the sale of the PSL 2023 was only around 60 crores. This accusation is absurd. He then also called upon Nakvi to investigate the matter and said that it is appalling that a valued professional in PCB was treated with such disdain and high-handedness all because of one party's personal grudge who had used its contacts to perpetrate this madness. According to the Pakistani newspaper The Nation, it was only after a series of complaints that the Interior Ministry ordered an investigation into PCB scams. All in all, in choosing to speak up in solidarity with an ex-colleague, Sethi seems to have stirred the hornet's nest.